Hello everyone, this is Danny from creatingawebstore.com and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to put your PrestaShop store in maintenance mode and then there's another mode called catalog mode so you can actually decide between the two. With maintenance mode what happens is people when they visit your store while your store is in maintenance mode they'll actually see a screen that tells them that it's under construction or uh, in maintenance mode I should say and with catalog mode people actually see your store as it is shown right here with the exception that they can actually make purchases in your store. So to put your store in maintenance mode simply go to preferences and maintenance and here simply turn on no and click on save and note that this is how this would look but note that this is a problem for you as the administrator because now you can no longer see your storefront because uh, it's actually being blocked so what you can do is you can actually make an exception and you can enter in the maintenance IP address and the way you can do this is by clicking on add my IP and then click on save and when you do that you can actually see your store also keep in mind that some internet providers actually change your IP address occasionally. For example, you might even have a dynamic IP address rather than a static IP address. So if it ever comes to the point where you can't actually see your store, simply click on the add my IP address once more in this uh, maintenance section and simply click on the save button to uh, register that new IP address so that you can actually see your storefront. Now, if you want to put your store in catalog mode, in other words, if your store is uh, live and ready and you've uh, fixed it up just the way you want it, you can basically enable shop and click on save. And then you can go to preferences and products. And here what you do is you click on catalog mode, yes, and click on save. And now people can see your store and your inventory but they can no longer see the price and they can no longer check out so basically that's that so thanks for watching stay tuned for more videos and also be sure to check out creatingawebstore.com